friends and I had some drinks tonight because we're all over the drinking age here in Canada and we like to have fun on Fridays every now and then. <clears throat> now, I'm going to watch the 300th episode of Grey's Anatomy. I'm so excited because it's going to be an episode like dealing with the ghosts of their past and it has an interesting intrigue. Plot. <laughs> Losing English. Anyways. That's what I'm here for. Yeah, it was a really great day. Had some really good food. Lots of fun with friends. Life est bon. Hey! So, today is very special in Canada because we remember our veterans and all, the, all those who lost their lives for us. And I think, you know, it's just incredible that, like, someone is so p compassionate that they would give their own life, you know, to, to help their country. So I always wear a poppy every year, and I watched the ceremony in Ottawa today on my laptop. I normally go to the one in my town, but I'm not in my town, and they don't celebrate Remembrance Day in the province I'm in now. Quebec, qu'est-ce que tu fais? They have their own day for it, but um, the rest of Canada does celebrate today. And we remember all those brave, brave soldiers who truly gave us the greatest gift of all. Freedom, life, peace, happiness, and now we can live without fear. And I think it's just beautiful, and thank you so much, better. So I've gotten this mysterious burger. Hopefully it's good. How you feeling, Sarah? The guard of the stuff. Like I said, what happens if this falls and the people underneath get crushed? Well, hope it's not you, Sam. Sucks to suck. So it was a splendid shopping day with my friends. I've hurt myself on my poppy so many times. Yeah, I got some food, so I'm gonna have mac and cheese for supper. And then I got some Bath and Body Works, one Christmas present, a vest, some food. So yeah, I might do a little show ya what I got. Tonight Sarah and I are going to go see a play. It's for one of my classes. But yeah, it was a fun day getting out with the girls. I always like having a relaxing Saturday and then I work every other day of the week. Oh no. Tourists. Tourists. <laughs> Joy. <laughs> Says the girl who just went to like 10 souvenir shops. You know, I'm looking for other people and not myself. So. They all begin to look the same after Yeah, all. they do. I thought we went to the same one twice. Exactly. <sighs> it's cold. Oh my gosh. It's Scalpy. really cold. <laughs> but we just saw a play. It was so good. So, so good. And we understood the French. It was weird. I like could follow it. Oh, and it was really like personal and oh, love it. Johnny said, then we'll just come on back if you ever want to try again. I told you once you saw some the best it's ever been. Played fire on the mountain, run boys run. The house, the rising sun. Hey, so it's been a good day so far. I did lots of laundry. Now I'm gonna go watch the football playoff game with my friends. I'm really excited. It's the first playoff game, and I don't think I've ever watched a playoff game. These ones are more intense. Um, <laughs> I've watched the Grey Cup and the normal seasons, but I'm becoming a true football fan. Yeah. <laughs> Are you guys happy we won? So happy! We did it! Wow, well, not quite yet. Eight, seven. Just let her run the ball. Yeah! Yay! Welcome to the money for the charity! So it's time for another grocery haul. I haven't actually bought like a whole thing of groceries since I got back from break, so <laughs> it was well needed. I got some ham for sandwiches. I got this huge block of cheese for $4. Back home, these are $8.48 on sale. It's because they have a lot of cheese here in Quebec. Got some ravioli, some peas. Hopefully I remember to eat them this time. A sandwich, because there's 50% off, and I figured by this time tonight I don't feel like cooking anymore. 
these yummy looking nachos and yummy looking sauce. There's like sour cream and salsa. Mm. And green onion. Yum, yum, yum. Beefaroni. A nice big fat tomato. Wasn't too expensive. Some clementines. Bagel bites. It's getting to the point in the semester where I'm busier, so I have to buy some food that's prepared already. This huge thing of beef for six bucks, so that'll be good for my burritos, and I can make more meat and it'll last longer and be more substantial as well. I got two shepherd's pies. There are two for seven. Some granola bars. My muffins as usual, because I haven't been having anything for breakfast. And sour cream. The bigger one was cheaper, so I was like, may as well, right? So that is what I will be eating. So I'm going to do a little mini haul of what I bought yesterday when I went to the mall. Oh, that rhymed. Isn't that funny? There are some things I can't show, though, because they're Christmas presents. But I did buy myself this really nice cozy vest, and it's so nice and warm. Like, my arms don't get cold. It's always, like, my shoulders and my chest. So I've been finding that it keeps me warmer than my jacket did. Um, also, my arms always get too hot, so I really appreciate not having arms on this. At Bath & Body Works, yesterday was $3.98 lotion day. So I got this awesome scent, Coconut Mint Drop. Oh, it smells so good. I love it. It's, oh, I love the smell. And Twisted Peppermint, which I've had before. I just love it. It makes me feel like I'm ready for the holidays. At Licenza, they had these little gift box underwear. And I thought they were so cute. And they were only $4. I liked the color of this one, so I got that. Regular 10, so I'm like, that's pretty good. And yeah, so that's what I bought yesterday. Also advice, stick with what you know. Like, <laughs> today I had fun watching football with my friends. Riders won! One more playoff game than Grey Cop. Yeah. Um, anyways, after I decided, oh, I'm gonna go to the grocery store, and I was like looking up on my phone how you get to this different one because the one I normally go to, the bus stop right in front of it, was closed. So I'm like, hmm, how can I make this easier for myself? <laughs> I didn't. So I went on this other bus, missed the stops, so then I had to walk a really long way to get there and a really long way to get back to another bus stop that was on campus, but it's like the other side of campus, so it helped me a little bit. Yeah, it w I like that store better. I find it more open than the other ProBigo. They had more variety. I got some cool products, but I was like, oh, so much walking. I just made life hard for myself, but that's me. It's what I do, so. So it's way better to do laundry in the morning. I went down there this morning. Every machine was empty. Tried to finish up last night and like I couldn't get in. And I don't mind it. I like the morning better anyways. I'm more chipper, more motivated, more productive in the morning. So now I'm buffing for breakfast. Hey, so today's been swell. I did laundry. I worked on an essay for theater class. And then I went to volunteer with my art teacher and my friend. And that went really well. I really appreciate the experience in the classroom. Most of it's just observing, but I think you learn a lot from that. And I'm already getting lots of ideas. And that's really what I fear going into education is that, oh, am I going to be prepared? Am I going to know what to do? Like, how am I going to come up with project ideas? And I think we really inspire from our own educators and those we are studying with. The kids were working on pop art projects and, uh, oh, I forget the name, Bengi or something. He's an artist that does modern street art about different social issues. Now I'm going to make burritos. And yeah. I am so excited to eat this. Look how delicious it looks. It's nutritious, delicious. I did lots of homework. I'm proud of my work. And now I'm gonna have a snack. Grapes, crackers, cheese. Put on my PJs and watch How I Met Your Mother. Ideal. So I haven't vlogged much today because I haven't done much today. Um, one of my, my partner came over and he and I worked on a project that's due Thursday. We got lot done we're done now we worked well together um and i did some homework on my own took a shower this morning watched how i met your mother and had lunch like this is all that's happened so yeah now i'm going to do even more homework because i have a presentation tonight a storyteller is going to come to our class and 
give us tips and tricks for reading stories to children. Hey, so it was a good evening. I really enjoyed seeing the storyteller story tell and give us tips and tricks just for teaching in the classroom even. And yeah, we practiced with each other. Sarah and I told one another stories. Yeah, I love presentations like that to really form you as a teacher because that's their biggest fear going in is like, we're not going to know what to do, we're not going to have ideas, but it's really nice that they have these really good workshops for us. And yeah, so I always find it interesting. I'm back into teaching mode now. <laughs> um, I don't know. I come and go. But I think I'm just going to go for the degree and then we'll see where life takes me. You know, you never know. You really never know. So yeah, but it was a fun thing to do tonight. I did all my homework. I watched How I Met Your Mother when I had my free time after I did all my homework this afternoon. Went to the presentation, saw my friends. It was good. Called Sam tonight, talked to mom. Off to tutoring, then class. Busy, busy day. So it's been a long day. And I, I don't, ugh, I just want to, ugh. <laughs> That's where I'm at. So I went to tutoring this morning. My friend and I got our work all corrected, and then I helped him pick out a cactus. Then we dozied on to our drama class, where we interviewed each other as characters and made tableaus of scenes from our fables that we brought to class. My other friend and I went to the art store and I got a nice big set of pencil crayons. Good quality for art class because tomorrow I get to draw a nude mom. Then after that, yoga class. And we did this pose. Yeah, I didn't know I could do that either. Don't know how your legs and body go like that, but it worked. It was actually kind of fun. Then I went to see Sarah, Anna, and Sharia. Sarah paid me back, and then I had a nice long chat. Then I ran home, figured I was already wearing sporty stuff. I was like, I want to get home quick. There I go. Called mom, had some more supper. Now I'm going to shower and sleep because I'm tired.